LA, Los Angeles is something like a hundred miles wide. It's a place where you can find anything you want to find, whether that's a group of people that you click with, or a certain type of food, or a certain community, whatever you are looking for, there's something that's going to connect with you in this town. Having a bicycle allows you to be able to see parts of the city that you wouldn't see otherwise. I think a lot of people in LA get in their cars and they're driving A to B and that drive is usually so stressful and taxing that they're not going to go out exploring in their car. I mean, that's sort of a lost art. You know, you don't hear of LA as being like a, so like a cycling city like Amsterdam, for example. And there's not really a, a huge infrastructure of bike lanes or bike paths, but there are a lot of people who ride and there is this kind of secret trail network that is just being opened up to me and just a whole community that is helping cyclists to understand how to ride through Los Angeles in the most pleasant and pleasurable way possible. The east side which is personally my favorite side. It's a bit of a mix, more of a mixed mixed bag. You, know, you get people from all over the place and different cultures. There's a huge art scene and, and fashion and, and bikes are kind of at, at the heart of that. Riding up to Griffith Park was the first ride that I really did on the east side of LA. It kind of blew me away that you could get up there and you could have such an amazing view and it wasn't just totally packed with people, you know? 30 minutes out of town and you can be on trails that make you feel like you're in the middle of nowhere. And that's the beauty of LA, that you can get that kind of, get that kind of release and escape from the hectic big city life.